just because I like to own everything about my devices. I'm thinking of rooting. What advice would you give someone starting out? Excellent question, Kristen. See how I did that? So now nobody's going to know. I actually went on and... Oh, now I already told them. Okay, uh, if you want to root your iPhone or jailbreak your iPhone, uh, you want to look into a piece of software known as Evasion or Red Snow. Uh, if you have the latest version of your iPhone iOS software, it will not work. Um, it just depends on what re latest release of Evasion and Red Snow there is. Um, and what it is is you can get uh, an application after you've jailbroken it. You want to get an app called Cydia. And Cydia is basically an app store for jailbroken iPhones. It's a very straightforward process. I do have to throw out this here at a, uh, as a liability thing um, that it does risk you bricking your phone if you do not use this software properly. You're going to be throwing a bunch of warnings like that when you actually go to use Evasion or, or the other software. And so I need to throw that out there as a disclaimer. And, um, and, and when you do this, it's, it's really like they've really streamlined the whole process. For the most part, you plug in your phone and you open their software and you press a button and it'll just walk you through step by step what to do. Uh, and, and they've just done a really good job with this whole jailbreaking process if you decide to do that. Now the reason you would jailbreak the phone, why would you do it, is so that you can have full control over a lot of features that aren't available on the base device because Apple locks you out of a bunch of services and products that aren't normally available. Now one of the downsides of jailbreaking obviously is you don't get the latest releases and your latest updates, but for those of us who are, you know, don't care, we don't care. You know, if we're going to be going in there and rooting the thing anyway, we probably are jailbreaking the thing. We don't really care about having the latest releases. In fact, we're probably heavily against getting the latest releases, uh, but it will limit you in that sense. Uh, but it also should walk you through. Uh, I also recommend you do a full backup of your iPhone device through iTunes before you even start. And so if you do run into a situation, um, you can reload that firmware back onto your device with the full licensed Apple software and all your available apps and everything you had on it before. And you can do that through your iTunes software before you uh, before you get started. So you want to look into Evasion or Red Snow, and then you want to download something called the Cydia app. And the Cydia app will give you access to a crap load of jailbroken app devices, app, apps, jailbroken apps, sorry. Sorry. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> Excellent question, Kristen, as usual.